Rahim, in this session we will discuss about the thirds and uh, third is an uh, is an irrational number of form under under root n where n is a positive integer that is not a perfect square for example under root 2 under root 5 and under root 12 are all, all thirds these two under root 2 under root 5 and under root 12 are third numbers we cannot write this under root uh, 12 uh, with a whole number while under root 9 is not a third it can be write down as a 3 so this 3 uh, under root 9 is therefore is not a third similarly under root 16 is not a third because under root 16 can be write down as a 4 so let's start uh, exercise 3.3 3, that is related to thirds and we have to simplify this a b c d similarly this question number two uh, to obtain a plus b a minus c and a 2a plus 3b similarly for 5a plus 2b minus c so let's start search a search is an irrational number of type uh, of the form under root n for example under root 2 under root 5 or under root 12 exercise 3.3 simplify this so simplifying we take out under root 5 as a common so here take 3 plus 10 so this is 10 under root 5 so under root 10 may be taken common so 3 plus 2 under root 10 so 5 under root 10 so similarly under root 11 can be taken out common so 8 plus 1 9 under root 11 so under root 3 may be taken common so 5 minus under uh, 5 6 minus 1 under root 3 so 5 under root 3 uh, a is uh, given as 3 under root 5 plus 7 under root 3 b is equal to 2 under root 5 minus 3 under root 3 c is equal to 2 under root 3 minus under root 5 so a plus b can be write down as a and this b and we open it and we simplify it and we have obtained 5 under root 5 plus 4 under root 3 similarly a minus c a is this and c is given as this so we will write a first and then minus sign and with this one so this is a this is c so this is 3 under root 3 7 under root 3 minus 2 under root 3 minus minus plus under root 5 under root 5 under root 5 4 under root 5 and uh, this is a difference so 5 under root 3 so this is this similarly 2a plus 3b this is 2 and this is a 3 and this is b multiply with this 6 14 so this is right down here so this is 6 and this is 3 9 under root 3 so 3 under root 3 this is equal to 5 under root 3 and this and this add up to 12 under root 5 similarly for this one now first four terms of a sequence is this 2 plus 3 under root 7 plus 2 plus 5 under root 7 2 plus 7 under root 7 2 plus 9 under root 7 fifth term is this and sixth term is this uh, sum of all five terms sum of all five terms is given as this 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 and this one so we have obtained this so we will <clears throat> add all whole numbers and this under root numbers are added separately these are the coefficient of this under root so we will add up this so we will add this expansion of nth term so this is expansion of nth term is equal to this one so this term can be write down as an is equal to a plus n minus 1 d under root 7 plus 2 because uh, 2 is the first one this one is a 2 is common for everyone so this will be taken as a common so here we have and this is so this is 3 n minus 1 and the difference is 2 here we can see the difference is 2 3 under root 7 5 under root 7 7 under root 7 9 under root 7 so the difference is uh, 2 so, so this is the uh, difference is 2 so n minus 1 so we can write down here this is 7 this is this so 2 uh, 3 minus 2 is 1 
two way like this sometimes. So this is the generalized term for for any values. So this is the generalized term expansion for any numbers. For this numbers we can be generalized like this. Now uh, we have a fourth question. Question number four that is find the exact length of AB. We have to find the exact length of AB. Find the exact perimeter of the triangle. So this is the perimeter. Or, or, uh, edging all the all the edges of this triangle. Adding all the edges of this triangle give the exact perimeter of the triangle. So if we have to find the exact length of this AB. These two lengths are given. So this is 7 and 4 and we have to find this length this in a right angle triangle. So the perimeter of uh, this ABC is equal to AC square plus AB square plus BC square by Pythagoras theorem. So this is 7 square is equal to AB square plus 4 square. Uh, AB square is equal to 7 square minus 4 square. So this is 40. 49 minus 16 is equal to under root 3. AB square is equal to 33. So AB is equal to under root 33. So the length of this side is under root 33. So we will add this together. So the perimeter of ABC is 7 plus 4, 7 plus 4 plus under root 33. So this is the exact length of this AB. And the perimeter of this AB is this. This is the exact length of AB and this is the perimeter of this right angle triangle. So, in the next session we will discuss uh, next